Do you smoke, sir? Sure, but <laughs> perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about these. Actually, well, take some. Take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <clears throat> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. The cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah? Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> A veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here, circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. But, you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now, you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rand, at your service. I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. You okay, boy?
Yep. Now. Okay.
Got some medicine. Better than nothing. Damn it, that won't help! Look at me! I'm bleeding out here. <laughs> Get too comfortable now. I won't. Well, rest while you can. We got work to do soon. Okay then. Yep.
Gotta get some food soon, Arthur. Food or money. But these bastards will eat up. I know, Dutch. I'm trying. A stew without good meat is no stew at all, Mr. Morgan. I reckon this I'm can't do with a few go. improvements. Why don't you take a look at my ideas? Thanks, Mr. Pearson. This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Hey, Arthur. What you want? Oh, man, you want sour, son of a bitch, ain't you? Only when I see you. Oh, only when I see you. <laughs> Oh, Arthur. Hello. Mr. Morgan, Mr. Morgan, you saved my... Is there any way we can leave this until later? Oh, all right. Not a problem, Mr. Morgan. Hi there, Arthur. Hi there, Arthur.
Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and... Try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. Of course you do. Without saying. What am I gonna do? You're gonna suffer. <laughs> and life's gonna go on. That's the truth of it. I won't lie to you. Oh, Miss Roberts. I know. Where, where am I gonna go? Stay here with us. Oh, thanks so bad. Nasty out there. Arthur. Ah, Miss Morgan. You seem chipper. But where there's lies, there's hope, my friend. You idiot. Yeah. Partner, come take a look at this. Look at this, my friend. Tobacco. Nature's gift to us all. Hmm. Focuses the mind like nothing else. Whatever you say. Well, I say, why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own? Well, plenty left here if you're interested. I'd best keep moving. All right, boy. Well, shit. Thanks, I guess. Tak, Mr. Robe. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. I'll bet Silesia. I'm here for money. You borrow from a German man? Aha, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the nah, Kaiserreich. I don't ja? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. That you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. 
Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh, no. No, nie, nie. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu. Znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. God damn it, you have a debt to Herr Strauss. Pay up. Stop! You stay mam siły. Nie, nie! Ah, no, 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 please, no, no, have money, but, but you have this, it's good, it's good, it's valuable, it's, it's Warsawa, yes. I have your things, okay? I have anything in here or out there? Yes. It's very valuable. Good? Not good yet. Better be something somewhere. about cover things.
Yep. collapsed. I, I, I don't know why. It's my friends. Oh, yes. Yes. Just lift as hard as you can. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You saved sure. me. Oh, that was okay. bad. Okay. Uh, sure. I could have been stuck here and starved or eaten. Oh, you poor, dumb animal. Oh. What'll I tell Mildred? <sighs> well... You need a ride home, ma'am? Oh... Oh, yes, mister, please. Thank you. Do you know Valentine? I live there. No problem. Travel. Slow down, please. Whoa, whoa. I was off inquiring about a possible new line of work. I, I'd borrowed a friend's horse for the trip. See, my husband... Well, it's just me and my boy now, and it's hard to find work. Mm, I'm sure it is. A good opportunity. That's what I'm looking for. Not much work for a woman with a boy to raise. I won't work in no saloon, but I've got sharp eyes and quick hands. Oh, slow down, please. Sounds promising. Also doesn't sound real. Oh, you may be right, I suppose. He said he'd provide room and board for me and for my child. He wanted to meet me first. I'd be careful with offers like that, ma'am. I can't afford to dismiss offers like these, even if they do seem... odd. Just be careful is all I'm saying. I may not have another opportunity like this. Now I'll have to pay Mildred back for her horse. Well, that sure sounds like you're in a hard position. You finding me is the only good thing that's happened to me in a long while, sir. We're close now. Just a little further. Thank <laughs> you. 
You fixing to come to grief, huh? Hey, what's with you? We're here. Thank you for all your help. You're a good man. Glad I was able to help. You take care. Appreciate it. You be well. Chick Matthews. Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh, uh, that's the greenhorn over there. Oh, and there he goes. So long, long shark. <laughs> Damn it. Hey, get back here. You owe us money. Yeah.
untie me and I'll tell you where it is. You're in no place to bargain, boy. Goddamn treasure hunt? You're lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. There ain't no reason to tie me like this. Aren't you gonna untie me? You got the map. Do the decent thing. You'll find it there. Everything. I promise. Yep. Yeah. You ain't done yet, girl. Where's that horse got to? 